Thank you for joining us today. I would like to welcome everyone to this important announcement. I'm Trevor Peterson, the NDP candidate for Cypress Hills Grasslands. I would like to introduce my fellow candidates behind me here. Vicki O'Dell, candidate for Cirrus Miss Mountain. Doug Untenbright, candidate for Yorkton Melville. Nal Kuyak, candidate for Regina Capel. Good morning everyone and thank you for everyone for coming out this morning for this uh, announcement. It's a beautiful day, we've been blessed with that. Uh, before I get into my comments, I want to note that Indian Head is a winner in the Communities in Bloom contest and my understanding is that the community orchard here was a part of that, that was uh, a partnership with PFRA. So let's give the town of Indian Head uh, a hand for uh, winning that award. Now, well, ladies and gentlemen, right here in Indian Head, the Conservatives uh, two or more years ago closed the tree nursery as part of the Omnibus Bill. It was a successful federal program that offered free trees to farmers and rural landowners throughout Western Canada for 108 years. Over that time period, it uh, distributed uh, close to 700 million trees to help farmers and rural landowners plant shelter belts to conserve soil and mo moisture. Now, you know, some of you know I was involved with the agriculture producers back then uh, uh, in this matter, and we, we were dealing with the town. Right from the beginning, my view was that the closing of this farm by the conservative government was sheer stupidity. Woo! And uh, you can take that pun however you wish it. Um, I do want to introduce two very special people today, special in my mind, and that is Gord Howe and Bruce ne Neal. They're back there, and these two gentlemen, put your hands up. These two gentlemen... Uh, we are both past managers of the uh, Indian Head Tree Nursery. They have over s close to 60 years experience between them and they fought uh, in the community and beyond the community to try and, and keep the tree nursery going. Ladies and gentlemen, in Canada and in Saskatchewan and Western Canada, it's time for a government who works with as opposed to against farmers. Tom O'Care and the NDP have a concrete strategy to support Canadian farmers. I'm pleased to announce here today that this strategy includes the restoring of the Indian Head Tree Nursery under a Tom Mulcair government. Here, here. Farmers are struggling to deal with the impacts of climate change, flooding, drought, volatile temperatures. Programs like the Indian Head Tree Nursery provide important support and research for environmental mitigation. An NDP government will work towards a stable, cost recovery, public business model that promotes environmental sustainability across the prairies and provides local valuable jobs right here in Indian Head and the surrounding communities. In addition, we will establish a long-term strategy for public agriculture research. And that will include an additional $40 million in investment in public agricultural research. An NDP government will implement a, co a rail costing review to ensure that producers have fair and efficient rail rates. We all know of recent studies done by uh, uh, the Wheat Development Commission and APAS and the Wheat Board before it that indicated that farmers are overpaying by as much as $6 a ton. We will conduct a review to determine what the case is and hopefully out of that farmers will save significant dollars. We will also address issues such as enforcement of service level agreements and ensuring that grains and oilseed producers have access to rail infrastructure in order to get their product to market. We will work with farmers, we will work with their organizations, we will work with provincial governments to ensure that business risk management programs meet the needs of Canadian farmers because in the last Growing Forward Agreement, the Conservative government gutted the farm safety net programs that are available to you. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the kind of change that farmers and all Canadians can trust Tom Mulcair and the NDP to deliver. I want to thank you for coming out here this morning. Please, if you worked here in the past, would you put your hand up? Let's give them a hand for the service to the tree nursery here. Thank you, Lauren. I want to thank you all for coming out. Uh, I want to thank uh, my fellow candidates for traveling good distances this morning to be here for this announcement. Uh, I want to thank the media for coming out. Uh, you know where to bark the ballot on October 19th. Thank you very much.